Deputy President Rugathi Gashagwa and other Kenya Kwanzaa lawmakers have today defended the government against mounting criticism over the high cost of living coupled with punitive taxation policies. All the leaders who spoke at separate church functions in the counties of Embu, Kisi and Nyeri heaped blame on the previous administration for what they termed economic mismanagement and pushing the country into a debt hole. Ayub Abdikadir reports. With mounting criticism and widespread public displeasure over the cost of living and high taxation measures, Deputy President Rigadi Gashagwa pushed back in defense of the government, starting with the equally contentious foreign tours by President William Ruto. <laughs> Na hivi karibuni nitatoa taarifa ya kila inchi rais ametembea na ile manufaa tumepata. Mimi mwenyewe nitaeleza. On the raging criticism over the hiking of taxes, Gashagwa led a chorus of Kenya Kwanza leaders with blaming the previous administration being the running theme. Ile ushuru ambaye tunachukua hautoshi matumishi ya Kenya. Tena tuko na madeni mengi sana tulikuta. Na hiyo madeni zio sisi tulichukua, lakini lazima tulipe kwa sababu ni ya Kenya. Be patient as you wait. Sababu kama Deputy President alituambia wamepata treasury enye haina pesa, economy iko ICU. I want to tell you our economy is recovering. This economy shall get up and get going again. The defense of the government comes amid growing public discontent over the newly gazetted increase in service charges by the Ministry of Interior and National Administration for Kenyan seeking government services. And just days after the Kenya Conference of Catholic Bishops called for urgent interventions to assist Kenyans affected by the high cost of living. Ayub Abdikadir, Citizen TV, Nairobi.